Welcome back to the Morning Blend. Well, with the big game right around the corner, it is time, of course, to plan your menu or what you're going to bring to the game day party. Retired NFL linebacker and world traveler Dahani Jones joins us with some snack pairing and game predictions. So nice to see you this morning. Love the bow tie. Well, thank you. This American Brain Cancer Society. It's a bow tie I made, uh, courtesy of Bow Tie Cause. You know, I, I we support probably 200 different organizations all across the country. So I appreciate you acknowledging that. Absolutely, you look sharp this morning. You're talking about snacks, but first, before we get to that, <laughs> I want to talk a little bit about your your insight into the big game coming up. My guess is that I'm a Bears fan, and I'm guessing that you don't think their chances are very good to win the <laughs> Super Bowl. Is that fair to say? Well, yeah, the Bears, yeah, they, 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 you know, everybody was, you know, hoping that they would, but, you know, I don't see them in San Francisco, you know, I don't see any, you know, it's blue, I will give you that, it's blue, okay, but the blue is a little bit different here in San Francisco. San Francisco. Yeah, so who's your pick for the big game? You know, I'm watching... All these different guys prepare. I'm, I've watched these guys the entire season, and I think that Peyton Manning, even though he got set back, right? He sat down, and Brock Osweiler took control and took charge of the team. That gave him an opportunity to kind of regroup and refocus. And I think that he's coming back, and I think that he's going to go out there and win the game. He's going to take home the Lombardi Trophy, and everybody in his family are going to be happy. The reunions are just going to be around all the trophies that they've essentially won in Super Bowl 50. What better way to go out? I totally agree with you, and I hope the Broncos win too. All right, now I want to get back to your style a little bit because you have great style off the field. And I always wonder, do people bring that into the kitchen too? Are you just as stylish with your snacking? <laughs> Look, I know everybody goes to Pinterest in order to find style, you know, upgrades and things like that. But if you go to Pinterest for hell of a good, you'll find cover the spread. And there's all these different types of adventuresome pairings. So while right here in front of me, there's a couple that we can think about right here. Look, shrimp and popcorn shrimp, French onion dip. I mean, who would have thought about that? Those are the types of things that you can do. All the different types of snack pairings that we can put together with hell of a good. I mean, we put the fun in food and there are eight exciting different flavors, whether you're talking about French onion or whether you're talking about jalapeno cheddar or whether you're talking about bacon horseradish, you can do any and everything in order to put it all together. And that's the great thing about hell of a good dip is that we're able to mix and match and create that taste bud touchdown in your mouth. I like that alliteration there. And I didn't realize that February was actually snack food month. What are your favorite go-to snacks? You know, I, I, when I'm thinking about snacks and I'm thinking about the big game or just sitting at home and something that I grew up on, I love pizza, right? There's so many different types of pizza, you know, whether you're having deep dish or whether you're having thin crust pizza. I mean, pizza right here, pepperoni pizza and hell of a good sour cream dip. I mean, it's fantastic. French onion, dip that, the pepperoni, it just makes it pop. It's just absolutely amazing. That's one of my favorite pairings. Now, other people have different ideas, whether they want to dip egg rolls or whether they want to dip tortilla chips or, or potato chips or, or corn on the cob. Everything is different for everybody. I love that corn on the cob idea. And, you know, the, the idea of dipping pizza, <laughs> my son always dips his pizza in ranch dressing. So I think I'm going to try the suggestion you have because I feel like he would love that. Uh, where can people go to find out more about good snacking combinations like the ones you just told us about? Well, you can definitely go to hellofagood.com. You can also go to our Pinterest page and cover the spread from Hell of a Good. And we'll talk about all the different adventuresome pairings that you can put together. You can add some yourself. I mean, just think about it. The reason why there's eight different fantastic, exciting flavors is because we want to be able to go with anything. And the big game, and, and regardless of who and where and what you're doing, you're going to have snacks. So why not complement it with Hell of a Good? I like it. Okay, last question. I'm going to put you on the spot. What do you think is the hardest position to play on a football team? The hardest position? Yeah. I mean, water boy, of course, right? <laughs> water boy. That's got to be the toughest job. I mean, really, I mean, to make water, I mean, it is, it is so tough. I mean, the ice to water ratio, I mean, some people are just really sticklers about that. But Aside from being water boy, which is really, really tough, I mean, 
Then, uh, yeah, well, there's linebacker, which I played. I mean, I think that's pretty tough. I had a feeling you were going to go there. Maybe water boy is a tough position because you got to deal with those <laughs> NFL players and their egos. No? No, no it's, it's not <laughs> egos. It's, it's ingredients. It's combinations, right? You know, we're on the field. We want the water to taste a certain way. I you know, get it's it. just like here. We want our food to taste a certain way, and that's why we're able to complement it with hell of a good. So when you're on the field, you have your water, ice, whether it's crushed ice, whether it's whole cubes. I mean, it's not egos. We're just little. We're just detail oriented. I got it. Great talking to you. Thank you so much for your time today. All right. Thank you so much. Absolutely. And here again is that website to find more great snacking combinations. It is hellofagood.com.